Hi friends, Right Careers welcomes you to a brand new video and first ever video of 2023. Yes, it's been quite some time since we put a video. Now, before we start this week's video, wishing you all, all our subscribers a happy new year and happy 2023 and a prosperous Pongal Shankarandi as well. Now, 2022 has been a mixed year for many, many industries, many corporate industries as the world recovered from COVID. Many industries also recovered from their setbacks that happened during the COVID. Uh, however, if you ask me whether the recovery rate has been uniform, has been patternized, the uh, answer is big no, because the recovery rate has been very, very mixed, I would say. Uh, if you look at the markets, if you look at various industries or corporates, companies with better turnover, say a turnover of over 250 crores INR did well. Whereas companies, small size companies, mid size companies or the startups didn't do well like the way it should have done, especially during the recovery period. Now, uh, that is as far as 2022. Cut across to 2023. For the last 20 days, there has been a lot of things that's happening in, in, in corporate industry. It, it all started with uh, on January 6th of 2023 when Honorable Prime Minister of India, Mr. Narendra Modi, in a, in a global summit, said that world today is in a state of crisis and there is no clarity as to how long this crisis is going to last now that's exactly the statement that mr modi made and this is definitely uh, if you ask me a disturbing statement because when the prime minister of a most powerful and influential country says that the world is today in, in a serious state of crisis and uh, there is a lot of uncertainty that surrounds the world it definitely is a disturbing factor now, after January 6th, till date, we are sitting on 23rd of January 2023, till date, four big things happened, four major things that happened that shook the entire world. The first thing to ha happen was from a company called Microsoft. Now, Microsoft, 15 days back, announced that they're going to retrench or they're going to lay off 5% of its global workforce or 10,000 people. They're going, they, they said that they're going to sack 10,000 jobs this year. This was followed by Amazon. Amazon said they're going to sack 18,000 jobs. And Facebook, uh, Meta, uh, Facebook's parent company, also said they're going to cut 10,000 jobs this year. Now, the icing on the cake or uh, adding to this fuel, a couple of days back, Alphabet, the parent company of Google, they announced that they're going to cut 12,000 jobs this year or 6% of uh, Google's entire workforce globally is going to be cut this year. And the CEO of Google or Alphabet, Mr. Sundar Pichai, apologized for this. He said a very big sorry and he said he can't do anything about it. Now, world today is now in serious state of shock over all these things. We all are in serious state of shock. Uh, we all know that we live in extraordinary times, right? Especially once the COVID started, we live in extraordinary times and extraordinary times requires extraordinary people to sail through and for extraordinary people uh, you also need to choose extraordinary careers to you know be future proof and that's exactly the topic that we have taken the topic we have taken for this time is uh, five careers that can be future proof or rather in demand careers for 2023 we will see one by one as to which are those careers which can be future proof if you studied in 2023 the first career that i can think of is of a full stack developer now, full stack developers or rather software developers uh, are someone who can work on both the front side or front end and back end of a website or an application. So they're basically jack of all master of none. They don't specialize in one thing. They don't specialize in Python. They don't specialize in Oops or whatever it is, but they understand everything. They work on both the front end and back end so that it becomes very, very easy for the company to allot project to them. Uh, you know, indeed, a very renowned, pro, you know, portal for job portal rates full stack developers as number two tech roles tech job roles for the year 2023 linden another prominent portal uh, ranks full stack developers as one among top 15 fastest growing jobs now the job growth of full stack developers for this year i mean it, it, it is expected to grow by 22 percent in the next seven years which is huge so if you are going to be uh, you know, make a career in software industry or being a programmer, you should become a full stack developer so that you can ride this boom or wave. The second career that I can think of is of a product designer. 
now product design is already you know one of the lucrative and highest paid jobs in the world now as a product designer you visualize you imagine you create and then you iterate the products that solves problem basically you create a problem you ideate you think you create you iterate it and solve the world problems now these products the product design these products could be either digital or non digital and the skill sets for becoming a product designer changes from the products that you choose if it's for example if you're going to become a digital expert you got to understand things like user interface ui ux etc so on and so forth so some careers in product development includes being a cad technician clothing technologists designers and various other designers and under design if you ask me there are 10 or 12 design portfolios that are there today including your ui ux etc fashion etc so product designer is definitely you know one of the most thriving career in 2023 i would say the third career that i can think of uh, that will do well to in 2023 and beyond is of a business analyst now business analyst what do they do they use data they collect data once the data is collected they they form business insights they they develop the business insights and recommend it to the businesses uh, for development so they can actually identify the real issues and challenges virtually in any any part of the business in any organization that includes it processes organizational restructuring staff development so on and so forth so if you enjoy working with people if you enjoy you know helping people if you enjoy asking questions solving problems working independently then definitely business analysis you know should be in your bucket list the us bureau of labor statistics projects you know the job growth between now this is 2023 and the next 7 years till 2030 to grow at a pace of 26 percentage which is massive so definitely if you are good at thinking analysis etc and if you have the eye of business you should definitely consider business analyst as a career the fourth career that i can think of is of a content strategist now content strategists love it hate it you can't ignore digital today right so creating relevant content uh, is very very key to survive for any organization in today's era if in digital space now things like blogs tweets articles you know videos etc uh, is, is making is already making a huge impact and that's going to continue for a long long time a content strategist use all the above factors that i mentioned like the tweets or the videos or the blog posts etc they use all these applications to the maximum for their business requirements in either forms now linkedin again linkedin today shows that about 537000 people having the job title as content strategist now two years back it wasn't heard today more than 5 lakh people in the world are content strategists so that means this is definitely a growing career you can also consider finally i also think you know uh, the next career that i thought was about data science i have spoken enough and enough about data science i have given the link in the uh, description uh, about a detailed video on careers in data science so data science is definitely going to hog limelight in 2023 and beyond so as data science you basically collect data you organize data analyze data and then make better decisions for the business it is a technical job there is a slight difference between business analyst and data science so data science is a technical job more of a uh, where you involve it involves people to understand things like algorithms uh, statistics analytics etc so in india if you ask me according to the industry estimates in india data science jobs are going to grow at a at a rate of 15 percentage in the next few years and you're expected to have over 11 million jobs by 2026 which is not far away so if you have that eye for you know data if you have the eye for arithmetic especially algorithms and statistics you should pursue mathematics and become a data science professional now there are other few careers that i also thought i will were worth mentioning you know these are some of the evergreen careers like law or a chartered accountant or medicine these are going to thrive forever and there are some new age careers like fintech which you have spoken before digital marketing public relations so on and so forth so whatever be the career that you choose you should keep in mind about how future proof they are and in case you want to know more about how these careers are going to help you and how these careers are future proof or not feel free to contact us all the credentials are mentioned below this you know a description and until next time with another new video see you all have a safe time thank you